Today we're going to talk about some important metrics that are going to help us determine the impact on our business in the event of a critical system going down. As a security practitioner, you're probably thinking, why do I need to care about business metrics? Well, if you get one thing from this video, if you forget all the acronyms and everything else, remember this one thing. Security is there to enable the business. Security is the servant of business. Don't forget it, or else you won't get your paycheck. I wrote out some important acronyms for this question. So the first one, the MTD, is actually just what it sounds like. What's the maximum tolerable amount of time a system can be down before the business suffers irreparable harm? This is like somebody being stabbed and you're bleeding out. How long can that person or that business go without patching that wound before you die? That's your MTD. And also keep in, keep in mind that a few certs call it the AIW. So depending what cert you're studying for, for example, the CISM, you'll learn this term as the AIW. So our next term is the recovery time objective. And the other part of our recovery effort is going to be your WRT. Depending on what cert you're studying for, these can mean different things. It could mean your software repair, your hardware repair, restoring backups, checking the integrity of your backups. At the end of the day, all you have to remember is both these terms are associated with recovery. Normal business operations are going on, and then we have something bad happen. We have an incident. We get stabbed. The COO has determined that our MTD is five hours. So we have to restore our critical server in five hours, or else the business is going to suffer. We also know that the IT team said that our RTO was two hours. So the question is, what's the WRT? All right, so we're bleeding out and we got five hours to fix this thing. So if our RTO is two hours, what does our WRT have to be? Well, if our WRT is four hours, four plus two is six, that's not good. All right, if our WRT were five hours, five plus two is seven, oh God. We gotta be faster than that. So if our WRT were three hours, oh, okay. Well, it's the same as our MTD, but that's not a lot of room for error. So if our WRT were two hours, well, two plus two is four, that's perfect. Remember how I said there was one thing you have to remember from this video? Well, I lied, there's two. Here's the second one. Your RTO plus your WRT has to be what? Less than or greater than your MTD? Speak up, that's right, less than. All this is saying is that there's a countdown clock in which you have to do your recovery, and if you don't do your recovery before the clock strikes zero, your business is gonna die, and you're definitely not gonna get your paycheck. This is a concept that sometimes gives students a lot of trouble, but once you've seen it drawn out on a Sierra Vista light board, it's pretty easy to get. And all of our classes and all of our teachers use this light board to take complex ideas and make it as simple as possible. So we hope to see you in a class, and we'll see you next week on Quitna.